The study done by Taylor, Brammer, Cameron, and Perrin also identified areas of concern for students. These were related to their sense of belonging, their ability to ask questions, and their perceptions of isolation and burden. At times, unless as a student you are proactive and strong minded, it can be hard to be heard loud enough. I noticed eye rolling of a staff member when asked to look after me for a shift. I found this quite intimidating. Student comments that demonstrated positive experiences included Orientation was a very nervous experience. However, it clearly showed me the documents that I would be using and the types of patients I would be caring for. This helped me settle into the placement quickly. The staff went to great lengths to allow me to experience a number of opportunities. In another study published in 2012 by Kalen, Ponzer, and Silen, mentoring was examined to obtain a deeper understanding of its impact on students. Three themes emerged. Let's look at what students said each time. The first theme was space. Students identified the preceptor as a person they could talk with about his or her life and experience as a health professional. These discussions created support and a sense of security for the student. I don't think I've talked so much with anyone else during the undergraduate program, except with classmates, about things like this. The second theme was belief in the future. Students became excited about their work as a health professional. Mentoring increased a student's motivation to study and to graduate. I saw a light in the tunnel, so now I will tackle this and finish my studies so I can work. The third theme was transition. Students gained a new perspective about becoming a health professional becoming part of a community of professionals. You could bring up your questions and reflect on things a little bit more. And you had a forum where you could do that. I think it has strengthened me in my professional role. Now it's clear to me how to relate to certain things.